Hey guys, welcome to a uh, guide I'm going to be doing on the Metal Gear Rising Revengeance boss fight against the Senator. Um, this is the way I did it, first of all. I mean, I this is probably like the 10th time I versed him, and he was kicking my ass up until this point, until I tried something completely different. Um, basically, the, the way I, instead of trying to block his moves, which is what I was trying to do in the previous fights, um, I started just to dodge it, which is by pressing the A and the X button on the Xbox controller and the X and the square button on the PlayStation controller just to dodge. It's an upgrade you can buy and I suggest you do buy it. Um, but yeah, if you don't have that upgrade and you're already up to this point, I don't, I don't really know how to help you. I did start this fight without um, any health packs, so I kind of had to make it to this point. Once you make it to this point, this bit this bit's the bit that I found the hardest to begin with. When he starts throwing shit at you, I kept dying for some reason. But once I, uh, you know, figured it out, so I'd always get the first one, and I'd always screw the second one up for some reason. But uh, as soon as you get to this point, um, you can kind of breathe a little easier because they drop some health packs, as you can see, and I instantly went up and picked them up. But there's this one point in the in the match where I'm not really sure what you do, but um, he would start regenerating health, and he would have green health all over him, um, and he, you know, obviously getting his health back. So what I did to win is I would go up to him and interrupt as you can see I'm just going to quickly equip the health I would interrupt his healing process and he would deal heaps of damage to me but he wouldn't regenerate as much I found that um, it didn't really seem like the right thing to do like it's like you know that's what you're meant to do but it seemed like it worked like I interrupted him um, from healing fully and when I wouldn't interrupt him in the previous attempts he would heal all the way up to like 150 but when I kept interrupting him, I kept him down to like, you know, 100 max. And I felt like that was the way to do it. So, um, yeah, I mean, really the only advice I can give you, and I know you're probably looking for some miracle special thing, is try to get in those quick time events. Because once you learn them, they're really easy and they can um, help you. Like, yeah, and like, you know, they, they do a lot of damage to him if you get this the uh, button sequence right. Um, try to make it to these sequences here where he starts throwing shit at you because once you master that you'll get health packs um, After this bit he throws stuff at me. I, I end up with five health packs. So that really lasts me to the end of the fight um, Yeah, when he's when yeah dodge really because that's pretty much the most important thing So like I'd hit him as much as I could and as soon as he started to move I would press um, the dodge button and I'd sidestep him or backstep, and that that really that's what really saved my life, I think. But um, leave suggestions in the comments if you have other better ways, because this is the way I did it, and I was kind of shit at this game. Like he would get really close to death, and I'd start to panic, and I'd forget what I was doing. But um, watch the end of the video uh, to the to the end of the video. I won't do any more commentary, um, but maybe you can kind of get some. Clues. So this is the bit where he starts regenerating. I was like, you know, effort. I'm just going to hit him. I know he'll do damage to me. He does about 25 there. Um, but he stopped healing. So now I can quickly get some damage in on him. Um, and I did that over and over and over again until um, he stopped regenerating and I was able to finish him. I um, hope this guy did help. Um, if it doesn't um, and, and you end up beating the boss, like I said, leave a comment and hopefully it'll help others. Um, anyway, guys, have a good one. See ya.